of Elizabeth Paradis and Francois Xavier Ouellette. They got an 86-79. That is a personal best for them, but of course we saw the mishap with the costume, so that will no doubt cost them the podium. But right now we are getting set for Piper Gillis and Paul Poirier, sitting fifth after the short dance. This is also their fourth trip to four continents. Their best result was a silver in 2014. <laughs> We often say about um, all programs that they're never really finished and one of the things Piper and Paul have really tried to do across the season is increase the movement between all of the elements, increase their speed across the ice while do the, doing that and keeping everything interesting. So you're always wondering, hopefully, what's coming next. Here's an ending for you, Piper Gillis and Paul Poirier of Canada competing here at their fourth trip to the four continents, looking if they can get back on the podium 
when they finished with silver in 2014. And a bit of an up and down season, wouldn't you say, as far Piper, as Gills Grand Prix doing so well there. But they were part of the Cup of France where they were only able to do the short dance. Sadly, the, the terrorist attacks in the ISU rightfully cancelled um, the free dance. But because of that, they were substitutes for the Grand Prix final, unable to go. Yes, but I think one of the things that's quite indicative of almost every team in this competition is that they've all had to face their challenges across their careers. And that's what you do. You know, one year it goes in your favor. The Shibutanis, Maya and Alex are a perfect example. They've had a but rough been waiting. few years. They've been waiting. And now suddenly this year, it seems to be their turn. So, you know, Piper and Paul are slowly building their skill set, getting everything organized, and they do interesting work. That's their goal, well, I think. Yeah, and I think this program showcases exactly what one of their goals is, is to stay curious about their own skating. And it's one of the things I talk about in seminars that I teach. Come on, kids, be curious about your yes. own skating. And that's what these guys do. And uh, and I know Piper's always battling a, a small tendon problem in her yes. ankle. That, it's probably call it lace bite yeah. in the business. Oh, I'm sorry. Right. Are they skate. doing the dab? Are they doing the, <laughs> they the, doing the dab? Are yeah. they football Korean fans? <laughs> They're going to put that in the program. <laughs> well, they needed an 83.03, but they get an impressive 98.27 to put themselves in the top spot right now. Working out the numbers in their head. Oh, already. Yeah, Eurus is doing the math. <laughs>